Hi! Welcome back to Primateer. Ah, uh, looking at the time, I still got a little bit more time for recording. And I honestly don't want to end a recording session in the middle of nowhere. So, the promises of last episode, we're doing right now. What do we have? We have a kinda useless raft, and what I use is a flagpole right here. And we've got two bowies. One we kinda destroyed a little bit. And one that's intact. And I'm gonna talk about the intact one in a second. Uh, I can leave it like that. It's okay, I guess. Let's get this thing. So, it's made out of one big block of ancient alloy, which means it transfers power, and one smaller uh, block of alloy. One battery right beneath the light, and the light itself, which ancient LED emits light when electricity is applied. Durability 40 or 50. Oh, are you kidding me? Ooh, angular speed. Oh, we could have used this one on the sea. Angular speed and speed in general. Ah, that's ang okay. So this lights up now because of the solar. Which even does work like this a little bit. Very unreliable. And this is how it's built. This one to keep it up float, so the heavy part is down. Then we've got ancient lightweight plastic. Which, imagine being uh, building a whole raft out of that. Yeah, I think that could be interesting. And then we've got, of course, um... This to, to make it stick out a little more, the battery, of course, for the nighttime and the light. And now I want everything of that. Hello? Okay, I can't for some reason. Huh? Wait, wait a second. This one to the side. I want to grab the raft and this. No! Mm, wrong button. I mean, it did come down, so it wasn't wrong, technically. It did work. Okay, we're gonna leave the raft here, as I said. Stick it to the ground. It doesn't want to stick to the ground for some reason. Yep, stick it to the ground. And from here, we go. So, I've got a respawn point here, interestingly enough. Do I need to activate it? Or do I just come back to the nearest respawn point? Oh, oh the respawn point has been activated. Okay, you put your hand inside. Uh, so please remind me that when we're back, I'm actually activating the respawn point over there. Okay, that was, um, now we know how they work. And if we've got an explody drone anywhere, we can just easily track back to where we've been. Uh, I'm only really scared about the bowies here, not about myself. And the island's pretty thin. We've got water on the other side already. But it is the same island we build on. I am pretty sure. Yeah, that's our beach, isn't it? That's the island we've... No, oh, wait. Is that the island we've been on? Eh? Where have we come from? Wait a second. I don't remember ice being here. Wait, where am I going? We've stranded there. Oh, I, I was going the wrong direction there. Okay, we've um, 
This shoreline, that's the island we've been on. Okay, this way. Now it makes sense. See, it's, it's, um, I've got a good sense of orientation. I mean, I was walking in the wrong direction, but I quickly caught on. So I would say I'm pretty good at knowing where I am. I actually am. If, if, if I'm running around a city I haven't been in, I am quick to find my way. I found out. Oh, another big stone. Why are we finding so many on this tour? Oh, I think I see silver, but there are red slimes all around. I don't want to grab it though. Ow. <coughs> I'm greedy. Oh, that's. Oh no, that's pyrite. Oh, that's not gold. Forget about it. So, we just have to walk this direction here. Uh, so the sun comes from this way. Um, where does the sun rise? East? Oh, I forgot actually. <gasps> How embarrassing. It's been a while since I thought about this. Oh, that's the stone by- oh, that's a yellow. <laughs> I know where we can get yellow slime from now. And I don't like that because yellow is dangerous. I've talked about yellows before, right? Oh, it's already eating. Oh, let's. Okay, let's despawn this chunk. Let's not have it active. Because they can end a world from what I've seen. They are dangerous. Mm, we've got a river. So we have to go through the stone biome? How deep? Ah, without... I could... What was that sound? Oh, it's a red slime! Where did this one come from? Ah. I have no idea why the light is flickering like this. And yes, I saw the tanks on the ground. I'm not greedy for tungsten right now, because silver is more important to me. It doesn't really help me being con uh, heat conductive or anything. Oh, I have to test conductivity in terms of electricity with silver and gold. I don't even know if they are conductive in real life. Gold, I think. I heard of gold wires. I may be wrong. That's why I'm testing. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a shore. I know because that's um uh, on the on the hill. You can see the um the base of a structure. This one is kind of like. Is it because of the battery? But it's but they're both static, so I don't know why it's flickering. That's something we have to find out. Yeah, that could be the where we started. Over there. Wow. We found out quite a... Oh, more tungsten. Okay. Good to know. And this is stone as well. So there's a potential of yellows spawning over here. <gasps> hey, and that's the windmill we fell. <laughs> and our boat... <gasps> Oh, look at that! I see the tree line! The tree line was such a good idea. Oh, we did it. Wonderful. I could go back for the raft. I don't know. Maybe off screen. But I already don't have too much time on hand. I think I have barely enough for this episode. Yeah, it was because of walking. I don't understand. I don't think I need to understand. Oop. Eh? Come on. Come on. To the ground. Okay. Don't. Just keep the balance. Uh, because we need to reset our spawn. I want to spawn over here and not have half a walkway away. Ah, good thing we kept the other stuff here. 
Imagine losing this. I mean, it's not lost. It, as I said, we can always walk back there. It's not lost. Ah. Oh. We've come so far. I'm so proud. Can I say I'm so proud? Technically speaking, I'm not proud of us because you're just watching. Which is pretty fine. I like that, too. What did I do last time? The respawn point has been... <laughs> you can see me jump. <laughs> Okay, I have no idea how they work, but no. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, now that we have a legitimate way to charge our stuff, I know exactly what I want to do um, during the next recording session. It's not important, it won't bring us further in any way. But it will be fun. <laughs> I can guarantee. I don't know if... Uh, I think I said that. I don't know if it works. Because I really don't know if it will work. But... I want to do that. So, I'm not going to tease what it is though. We will have to find out when the time is there. For now though. I'm going to take this. Oh yeah, I have to get my stick back to connect this. Uh, it's alright, I guess. I should change out um, this thing for a battery. So we're doing this again. We're taking one of the batteries from here. This one. Oh, wait, we're taking the light. So, which means I have to dismantle the stuff up there. I was way too quick with the solar. Um, yep. Excuse me? Okay. Getting this, getting this. Put them away. Getting the light and the battery. There you can see it. It is a different light. Um, so you can see from... Oh my god, okay. It is brighter. You can't tell me otherwise. Um, here, just in comparison. It would be great if we had night time right now. Oh, it doesn't conduct. <gasps> good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Um. So this comes here. Eh, it's all right. This here. All right. All right. So now I can. Look. It looks like it's the same brightness, but this one has a bigger radius of light. You'll see, you will see. Uh, nope. Nope. Let me up. And the second one around there as well. Oop. Come on. Come on. Hey! The okay. And, well, of course. I mean, it has charm, doesn't it? I just don't know if it's electrically connected. Honestly, I don't know if they conduct electricity. Like, if this one... Hmm. Just in case, I would say, just in case, we're getting one of these. 
Whoop. I said Allah whoop. Hello? Let me up! Okay. And connect. So this should be... Yep. Looks good. Okay. So we've got this going. Perfect. And now we run back to the beach to get the... Mast? Or what it's left of it. And I guess we can always get another windmill if we want to get one for the raft. Let me take every metal from here for now. Because I don't think we will have water anytime soon around us. I first will want a propeller, to be honest. I know how. But there's no reason for now. I mean, we can always build up on the solar stuff and so on. Uh, but that's not for today. Or anytime soon. The recording session for today is nearly... Well, we're halfway. Now it's back to base decoration and sorting. I mean, after a long trip? What else to expect? Okay, oh no. I have to get ah to get this one down there in some oh like this <gasps> perfect okay I thought it would be more complicated honestly this one still works uh, this one doesn't have to work anymore because <laughs> okay uh oh. Wait a second, I don't want them to be connected directly, though. Or do I? Wait. Wait a moment. Uh, where did I... Um, there's the rod. Um, I don't want this rod, so... Huh. Okay, here's the idea. Can I reach? I can't. I can't reach. Um, perfect. Let's get this one into the base. And better not drop anything on it, because it will just get destroyed. <sighs> or drop it on anything. And jump. <laughs> oh god. It, it has a mind on it of its own. Let's connect it to the ground. Now it's safe for work. All right. So I'm taking one of them, putting them back here. Um, halfway. Halfway. Taking this thing, putting the other one halfway here. Yeah, it's a... It's, uh, I hope you can excuse me the gap. I don't want to correct it. So, now we have these. And with these. Uh, now my legs are in the way again. I hope that's okay. Wait, there's not really a reason to have it on the ground, is there? I can just put it here. Put the... Batteries around like this. Now if I reconnect them, we have a battery pack. So they will be charged by solar. And we can connect this little contraption just so we have something in the night. Okay, now let's get these in. Ah, I can't see with a big number in front of me. Yunk. They're full. Wonderful. <laughs> and with the boys, it's kind of the same as with the windmills. There are so many... Well, not many with a boy, but a few... Uh, how to call them? Like Dean parts. 
that have the same size on every spawn, which makes building very easy. Like, look at this, perfectly um, aligned. So with this battery, we can see how much charge we actually get from solar energy. Although the, the other batteries will uh, work on this as well. So I don't think there's a real way to, to check. But it, ah, well, the, yeah, uh, the white number. Does it change? It feels like the yellow bar changes. Yeah. I mean, whatever works, right? Whoop. So, whoop, voilà. Now I can't see. I mean, we can make this pretty anytime again. For now, it just works. Okay, get the short one. Um, so we can use more batteries here. Although not directly on the line there. Uh, let's do it like this. And like this. Nice. That should be good. And the last battery. Let's say, oh, the third last. Okay. Uh, do we have another of these? Where did the short ones go? One is here. That's good. And there's one. And if we need a battery, we can always grab them from here. I mean, what I can do actually is have one battery. Just off the side like this. So it's constantly charged. So if I need a battery for anything inside the base, I can just grab it and have it ready. So this one comes back. Oop. Oh, and it's turning nighttime, so you can actually see the lamp in action. Nice. Um. Taking this. This way the motor will still work. Nice. Although I should put the indicator somewhere else, like here, I feel. Now I have to test if the indicator actually works. Yep, indicator works. So we can get heat, well, quick heat, uh, anytime. And this one? I don't know how much electricity it uses. Egg? Wait, actually, um, do I have... Jump and run. <laughs> what I can do here is be a little fence. Oh, no, come on. Okay, let's um, put this here for a moment. <sighs> let's go up the same way as the last time. Wow, something makes me jump off for some reason. This game is not made for parkour, or I am not made for parkour. Oh, pff, of course, because of course. Let's do it the easy way then. Haha. <laughs> because this is a viable way to do it. And it's. Ah, uh, it's not perfect. Uh, no, I want it to be perfect. I do have the time to make it perfect. Let's go all around again. Oops, what are you doing here? Um, uh, 
It's hard to see actually, but it looks, yeah, it looks okay. I would say it works. It's like an ancient monolith thingy. Huh. And can you see all oh, the light range? I should have put, oh my god, there are batteries. Um, oh, this battery loaded into these. But they are still charging the light. Ah. After a few in-game days, we should check on the battery packs again. One is completely down, the same as with the one above, and three of them are still loading. If they are empty or full, that would be interesting. So we can't do anything with electricity for the time. Huh. Uh, yeah, let's let's keep it how it is. You've got the perfect picture on how the battery pack looks like. And if two solar is enough for two lights and the batteries, that would be quite perfect. Because we don't always need the motor, so we would always charge. And if you thought this would be complicated, well, it's not really complicated. Look at this. It's a simple. This is our charger. It connects to one safety battery, which connects to a light. Well, which connects to a pole, which connects to a light. And the pole connects to two other poles. The most complex thing, because this doesn't do anything anymore, uh, is this lever here, which only changes if we. Push it over. Hmm. Actually, uh, let's take this thing. One is enough. Uh, put this on here. Perfect. No, wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? This is not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. And this. This is so much easier now. <laughs> Oh, I like it. And this way we can deal with any electricity in this house. And this is small scale. We can go so much further. Especially with the... I call them cables now. Because that's their perfect job. They, it's like they're made for this purpose. We just need a few more windmills to really make use of them correctly. And I wonder if you can make a precision cutter with a motor, or if that would be overkill. Also, I would be interested in how to reverse a motor, and if it's possible. I am not sure, to be honest. What would be interesting as well is... Taking this one away. This is not connected to our main line. So the motor function on its... Functions on its own. So what I want to do is get one wood. And one burning material. Just put it on the motor and see if it's... Wait, this is the... Which is the rotation direction? Ah, here's the test. Okay, we are not using wood. We are just using hay. Dry grass, sorry. Uh, that that's sulfur. What did I? How did I? Where did I? My ex fell apart. After our relationship, it's not the same anymore. <laughs> uh, let's be cheaty here and take this thing. Just a small piece. That's all I want. Just for testing. And the popsicle is still alright. Wonderful. 
So this one goes up here. So what do we check? We check if the lamp will go on. If the lamp goes on, we have something good going here. Ale, whoop. Ale, whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Here's the police. Oh, there we go. And the lamp is not on. <sighs> oh, God. Are you kidding me? It's just a piece of dry grass. Hmm. It's connected the wrong way around, I would assume. Ah, uh, too bad. Okay, now that this is burning, actually. Now that this is burning. Let me demonstrate something. Oh, wow! That was a quick burn time. I'm more used to the, to the big pieces that burn a little longer during the night. Oh, well. Oh, my. Now the motor is fighting with the engine. I wonder if it cuts down with ice, but I can't really bring the ice here, so it doesn't really matter, does it? In terms of electricity, I can take this one. Bump. Ah. Yeah, okay. Where do I want to connect this? I don't want it to be quite in the middle. Uh, let's have it here for a moment. Okay, it's not going into anything. Are these the... Oh, oh we've got the big connectors. We've got the big connectors, which means I can use them instead. Yeah, right. I know how. Wonderful. We're doing it in the backside. Because we don't really need anything here, do we? Oop. Oops. Oh, wait, one is enough. So, it's still not connected to the motor. We will have to do this with a lever. This one goes away. And this is still plastic. This doesn't conduct. This is alloy. This conducts. Alrighty. Uh, this can go down here. Okay, sorting everything back to where it belongs. Nope. I want to grab the big PC. Ah, blah, blah. I've got drones on my face. Alrighty. In just a moment, the base will look a little bit better than it did before. Um, what? Oh, the motor is gaining and... Wait, wait, that's good. Okay, wait, 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 uh, you... Um, you stick to the ground. I hope this won't lead to any problems. Where is... <laughs> now, finally, it makes sense. Pyrite. Pyrite is a diode. It only color conducts electricity in one direction. So if we put this on here. A little bit better than that. And have our LED on the pyrite. Um, here. So this conducts backwards. So it only goes from this direction to this direction. So the motor won't gain any energy from the main system. But the main system will gain energy from the motor. Which I must admit is a little bit silly because now we kinda... Uh...
screw ourselves over with our solar experiment. But I do want to keep the... I do want to keep this for a while. I mean, whatever fits those batteries up. That means we can use batteries for a while. One of my fears in this game is that when I connect anything to the main structure, this will connect as well. I don't know, this sometimes happened? I don't know if I did something wrong or if this is actually a thing that happens here and then. So what are we do going to do with this? First off, getting the silver. Hello, my silver friend. And we have another... We have this uh, to check, we have that in the back to check. Um, hmm. We can check if the lights, uh, if the solar is on. <sighs> and you know what that means. Ramp time! Okay, the ramps can't too steep oh god i don't like the ramps technically i don't need the lever here anymore eh, come on i connected oh that's too high huh yeah that should work all i want to do put this here if this doesn't glow, it's night time. So it's an indicator of when the solar itself is working, because the battery is only one way. I mean, we could use a battery instead of an... Uh, in instead of pyrite, but oh well. The problem is pyrite can turn into hematite. No, wait, into straight up iron at some point. So it's always a better idea to have a battery instead of pyrite. Especially if you work with motors. I don't think the motor there can go to any heat. Whoops. But I mean, it is better safe than sorry, right? Uh, let's do it this way, yep. I mean, it's good if we connect it to anything but a motor, in my opinion. So this will of course empty out into every other battery we have there. So much about the test then. <sighs> Once our energy drops, we can we can just disconnect everything, um, build up the energy in the batteries, and build ourselves a motor boat. That's one way to do it. So let's get these everything where it's supposed to be. No idea what to do with this light. I don't really need it. We're not doing that many circuits here, not yet, at least. You're already seeing how this can go out of hand. And this on a moving contraption, like, like a boat? With where the motors actually do stuff? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I wonder if you can do something like a hot air build. Nah, of course not. I explained like one or two episodes ago that heat doesn't really radiate or travel up. Sadly. Anything inside of here? Yeah, the sliced apple. What's my health? Yum yum. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. Okay. Uh, this can stay here? Yeah, why not? Okay, everything's sorted. Oops. 
Uh, not really, because I'm missing an X. Don't tell me the X is still on the beach. It certainly is. Uh, maybe I built myself another set of tools then. I'm gonna take it back because we're not building a boat anytime soon. Do 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 do. And since I'm on my way back, anything I want to bring back with me? Wait, shouldn't the X be around here somewhere? That's not an X. It should have been here. Am I missing something? Is it on the base? Oh, here it is. Oh yeah, because I was doing the rudder. Right. I can take this one. Any interesting pieces around? Anything I can use for building? I mean, clay I can use. Yep. Uh, not really. I don't need the rubber. Huh. Was it an episode? Uh, oh, we're actually over. Okay. I mean, it was worth it, in my opinion. Everything looks fine. And there are some projects on my mind now. So, first of all... Whoops. Let's get rid of this. And... This is one of the bigger pieces, actually. So, it goes here. That's my X. And we've got one piece of wood here. And everything sorted. One der full. Oh, I love it. It looks janky for now. We can pretty it up, I guess. But it does look good. Oh yeah, wait, the light is still on. No, the light is off. Which means no energy from the solar, only from the generator. Which battery is powerless. So they are powering up now. As the only thing draining power are the lights. If we decentralize the lights from the main system and having them on a different set of cables, uh, we could do something like a new light switch, which we could have here on, on the main door. And I could do something like... This. To, to actually have a door. I don't know how well that idea would work. But it would be an idea, alright. Eh, we'll see about that. Wow, where is the camera right now? Whee! Just scouting a bit. Ah, nothing, nothing much to see. Okay, let's get it back. Hi! Bask in the glory of my electrical home. Isn't it wonderful? I love it. I would play around like switching the lights on and off, but it's all in the same system. Can't really do much about it. Still fun though. Only thing I can do. Hey, let it heat up. Let it heat up. 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 20, 30. There we go. It's gonna explode. I love it. And I can keep it going how, for how long I want because we got the 
battery pack. It looks healthy on the in-game screen, but I have my window in front of me and it looks just like a white orb and the sound is horrible. Okay, I do need to grab it. Okay, it's coming down. <sighs> I shouldn't touch things that are in high motion. I don't want to end with an ugly sound. Can we can we relax? Oh well. <sighs> oh god, I'll, I look scary in this light. <sighs> oh look at how illuminated this place is. It was so worth it. All the problems. So, so worth it. Oh, I love it. Well, with this and a few other ideas still in my mind. The next one already thought out. <laughs> I will see you next time around. Oh, I can't get enough of this. It, I don't think it will look that good on flat screen, but in VR? It's not much, but it's it's ours. <laughs> Alright then, see you around. Until next time, bye bye.